Most people in life are looking for how do I make a life worth living and return with having. To do this, we try to acquire life balance. I've made some simple little PowerPoint slides that talk about life balance in the way that I learned it long ago. And I added things to what I learned because I didn't think it was in full balance. I didn't think it handled philanthropy very well. And openly, we have to be willing to do service for other people in our community. But what I can tell you today is that people are really unwise. They often forget that faith is the foundation for everything. A person's faith, a person's spirituality, a person's religion, a person's kind of, well, religious community is supposed to be about getting their life on track with God. Everyone in the world, including the president and vice president, want to control God. But I hate to tell you this, God is his own supremacy. God is his own entity. God is everything that people think he is and more. Pardon me. Mother God gets virtually no play, and that's really not fair to her today. But the truth is there is a mother and father God. Now, in life we have moments of time to speak the truth about what we're doing in the world. What I'm doing in the world is creating content, constant video content. But does that give my name accolades? Not necessarily. Because a video company like YouTube can just start hitting people like me to say, Oh, he's only we don't have to help him. Let him starve to death. And then you're like, okay, we get into the situation of way back when, when the haves versus the have-nots were controlling America. It's some of the things that politicians are fighting for. It's some of the things that we in our communities should be rooting for. The truth is that anyone can rise in America is usually true. But if we have technological companies that are saying, oh, this is free, but it's really not free, and we're really not getting play, then we're going to stay where we are today. What I'm talking about, of course, is a little bit different for me, but what I'm saying to you is you can't control God. At no time can a human being control God. And when you try to control God, when you try to control other people, when you try to do these things, you lose the blessings from God.